Hello everybody and welcome back. Oh, welcome back to Stardew Valley. In the last episode we got our house upgrade being worked on. Now I guess this also takes three days. I didn't know for sure because I've done it so few times. Clear and sunny tomorrow. Yeah, this is our second rainy day in like a week, so. Displeased spirits. That's fine. So we did finish the mines in the last episode. That's kind of important. But for the rest of the season, first of all, I need to go ahead and complete all my summer bundles because I don't... Oh, that scared me. I didn't expect it for some reason. Did she... Bro, where's my lightning rod? Is it still there? I think it... Okay, it's still behind her. Uh, flip this letter over for instructions on how to make a super healthy meal. The red plate from Emily. That must be for getting uh, seven hearts with her. Uh, so I need to start working on wrapping up the season. And for today, that's going to include filling out the bundles that I've missed. I want to start upgrading a few things as well. Now that I have 8,000 gold, I should be able to upgrade something else to... What is it? Uh, iron, steel, whatever. We also have our first cheese. We can take that to the animal bundle. Or is it our, the artisanal bundle? Oh, no, it's not. Hold on, what? I guess it's only big milk. Big milk. Cool. Well, yeah, that's my first priority is to absolutely. Oh, please tell me y'all weren't hungry all day. You can't get stuff out of this without... If you have something in your hands, it bothers me a little bit more than it should. I should put a, you know what? I have an idea. I'm going to get enough wood to make another chest right there and there. So I don't have to walk all the way out here. Oh yeah, we're also waiting for more maple syrup so I can put that in my sturgeon pond. So we can get some more sturgeon, sturgeon. What am I looking for? I'm looking for wood. I have my wood in my inventory. In that case, we'll craft a chest. Uh, we did hit another level in combat. I forget outright. I think we got the we got the slime egg press, which doesn't really mean anything for us right now. But later on, we could use it. I want to say we got one of these rings unlocked as well. I just don't know what. Solar essence and iron bar. You know what? If I get the solar essence for that, I should make that. Because what does it do again? It's, it's just glowing, right? No, it's both light and increasing your radius. So that would be just an outright upgrade to what we have. In fact, looks like I have the stuff for it right now. Hold on, I'm doing that. It, I, I needed to do this for a while because we've only had two small magnet rings and they're really kind of useless for us right now. And I've been having a problem where it's so dark outside that I can't even see what's going on. So this will help with that. You'll see how useful that is. I'm just gonna place this like in the corner uh, the pail's gonna go into it whenever I need it to. Also, uh, it is notable that cows do gain friendship a bit faster. Why does Randy have no milk? Randy, what's going on? Cows do get friendship a little bit faster due to the fact that they are milked, and that increases their friendship as well. Let's get some more of these going. What do I have? A lot of... Okay. Uh, who? I don't know if I want to make the copper ore. Well, hmm. I'm going to need some copper bars, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. What did I... I don't need that. One, two, three, four. Because I could use the copper for making more furnaces, but I think, honestly, we're good at where we at, we're at right now. So I'm not worried about it. Yeah, all right. So this is going to be a day where I am focused... I cannot believe cheese isn't used. Actually, hold on. It's Friday. We can go and sell this stuff off right now just in case. I mean, I, mm, I'm not going to need 5,000 more, so I'm not worried about it. Pop these in. Oyster. Keep all of that. I'm just going to do a little bit of inventory management, and I'll come back out once I'm ready. All right, it would appear that I have everything I need for my bundles. So we don't have to worry about that anymore. But yeah, I, I think it's a good day to go ahead and do that. I wanna make absolutely sure. Hold on, I didn't pet my chickies. 
I want to make absolutely sure that I don't mess this up because I've been cutting it really close. At this point, if I were to accidentally like eat one melon, that's it. It's it's GG's right there. So I need to be really careful. I also am going to go ahead and put this maple syrup in. I know we have the Surgeon Pond quest, but we'll get maple syrup later. And I'd rather get this over with now rather than later. Now, one thing I do have to start focusing... Why are, are sweet peas like the most common forageable item in summer they must be because i just have so many it is so something to note if you are missing grapes to make your summer seed packets you can plant them later but i'm not sure how profitable that will be specifically because it's a oddly enough it's a fall crop but it's foraged naturally in summer so you know one of those things uh egg first of all we'll be able to complete this hopefully in fall i brought all of my blueberries because i don't want to forget it Put a regular blue bee there, regular melon. Be very careful not to put in our gold star ones. And that's a quality sprinkler. Crazy how that happens, huh? And on our quality crops, the gold melons can go in. Didn't we have a quest to bring someone a melon? Well, yeah. Yeah, that's just unfortunate <laughs> that we don't have any more melons to use. That's fine. I really don't care about waiting until probably winter. To do that or maybe a little later we have our fall crop oh we can just bring corn in i thought it was specifically only for the quality crops bundle that it was pulsing but no well that's fine we have the corn oh my goodness dude let's see we should have a little bit of stuff for the exotic foraging maple pine tar it's done look at that that gives us five autumn bounties Plus 220 energy, 98 health, 2 foraging, and 2 defense. That is actually kind of crazy. I'm not sure when I'd use that foraging level, but sure could. Then we have our fall foraging bundle that's already halfway done. Look at that. All right. Did we bring anything else? I have the mana. I don't think I have anything else. I want to make sure that I have all the... No. Make sure I have all of the fish that we're going to need because I don't want to miss out on these. Even though I'm pretty sure most of them could also be found in fall. Okay, so here's a fun one. We do we can get this red snapper actually. And it's only found in the rain. And I'm not quite sure how I forgot about that. But hey, isn't it funny that it just happens to be raining? Okay, then we'll go and get that. I do actually need so i want to go to the traveling merchant obviously i need to 30 copper ores i'm assuming i have to get those during the duration of the quest i'll go ahead and sell my bluebies here because who cares make it easy on us boom on bounty all five of those are 1750 no i think it's honestly going to be worth it more for the food than anything else I don't believe there's anything I need to buy from you. Uh, if I wanted to buy, you know, all those winter trees, now would be the time, but no. Can't happen. Some cooking ingredients. We'll be able to use that soon. Could get the grass starter recipe. Yeah, there's not really anything else I need to get. So I have 11,000. I've already bought the, the house upgrade, which is 10,000. So that's nothing. I've also already bought the inventory upgrade. Uh, one thing I do need to start working on, however, is the the vault bundles, which are... What are those amounts? It's like altogether, I want to say like 30-something thousand. So we've got 25, 20, 25,000, 5,000. So let's see. 35, 40, 42, 500. Which is a lot. I want to start working on that so that it'll be done by the end of fall. That might be a little bit, a little bit tight, but I think we could do it here just because I'll grab this gold. I can't see my number. Four, and I'm going to buy one, two, three, four, five. We're actually going to need more iron. Wait, hold on. Okay, no, never mind. I was going to say we were actually going to have to get more iron ore, but I wasn't seeing how much we actually had. I'll go ahead and put this cheese away too. Uh, I'll meet you at the traveling cart. All right, gamers, what is up? What do you got for me? 
Now, honestly, if you had a rare seed, I would take it right now. Sandfish, if you don't want to go out and get it yourself. A duck egg as well. Huh. It's a bit expensive, so I'm not going to get it, but you could. Yeah, I'm going to take another rare seed. Uh, this is strategic thinking. It's almost fall, so I think it'd be worth getting more of those. Because they will pay out a lot sooner than we they would have if we bought it in, like, spring. This is also the point where I'm going to have a bit of disposable income. So, I don't mind spending that extra money. Now, real quick before I forget, what am I going to upgrade? I don't even know, dude. Weather doesn't really matter to me. I typically stay in my shop year-round. Year round. Cool. So, let's see. I want to do a steel item, obviously. I still haven't done the copper trash can. Uh, I'll do that later, whenever we have more copper bri bars to use. Let's see. Watering can or hoe? I think generally we'll get more use out of the watering can. Let's do... What do you mean? What do you mean I don't have five iron bars? What happened to them? Oh my god. Well, you know what? Thinking about it now, I don't want my sunflower to die. So I'll just go ahead and upgrade the hoe. No big deal. Honestly, I could have upgraded something to gold if I really wanted to, but I I don't feel any pressure to do that quite yet because we're going to need a lot more money to make use out of gold items anyway. So I'm fine with skipping that. Uh, I'm going to go catch that red snapper. It can be caught before 7 p.m., so we have plenty of time. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Now we're going to get worms out the wazoo. I should have considered that. It's a rainy day, so a hoe would actually be a lot more useful. You know what? Okay, so I, I it was pretty easy to catch the red snapper. It's already too late to catch any more of them. I got another, two iridium ones. They're not really worth anything, even though they're pretty... They're not rare when it's raining in the summer or fall time, but even though they're not caught in many circumstances, they're pretty cheap. That's only 50 gold, which I think... We can literally, like, check the price of everything. I always forget this. Like, 50 gold for that... For reference, a red mole at 75, and that's, like, catchable at any time in the summer, basically. Except at night. I think it stops the same time that the red snapper does at 7. So what I'm going to do here is we have a little bit of time to throw away. I think I'm going to go into the mines, and we're going to try and catch another specialty fish that I was thinking about. Oh, I should just go to the... Uh... Thank you. That's really loud, and it scares me every time. We should go to the underwater lake now that we're a much higher level we should have a better chance of catching it and we're going to catch one of the specialty fish all right so here in the mines i believe we're going to go to floor 20 easy like that and now it is a very high rate of catching trash in here but i'm going to do my darndest to stay here long enough to get this fish here we go. Now, it's not too terribly hard to actually catch. So keep that in mind. Bada boom, bada bing. Ghostfish. Now, since we did that kind of quickly, there's something else I want to show off. Floor 100. There's a lava lake here. There is yet another fish you're able to catch here. Let's see if I can get it. Well, let me tell you what. If you're short on trash, there you have it. Yeah. Nothing. Got four driftwood. I mean, hey, Leah will be happy, won't she? Hey, I can take pretty much everything else out of here. My one blueberry. Oh, well, I guess I can't. Uh, leave in the slingshot. I have a master slingshot, so there's really no reason for me to have that. I guess the rest of the day... Oh, look at this. That glow ring is working. Yeah. So normally when you're, like, walking back, especially in the rain when it's this late, pitch black can't see a thing so you can see how much that helps i'm gonna do a bunch of inventory management i'm gonna try and remember not to deposit my red snapper 
I think we're actually going to have to go back to the mines just to make sure that we're getting a good steady flow of charcoal, to be honest. Because, I mean, we're already down to 29. And I, to be honest, I'm going to need more copper eventually. Uh, tomorrow I should make it a point to sell all of my armor and weapons that I'm never going to need. So I'm going to keep those in my inventory just so I know for sure. Not going to be able to open these geodes until a little bit. I forgot we had an iridium bar. Good lord. Uh, yeah, we ought to have some more battery packs as well. Jeez, I really juiced everything I could out of that day. Let's sleep. Yeah, a good amount of money. Look at that fishing money, though. Wow, what really did it? Oh, two tuna, two iridium tunas at 200 each. Yeah, that'll get you. And of course, a, a lot of other stuff that's not too bad at all. 3,000. Yeah, I'd like to start seeing numbers like that more consistently, to be honest. Which shouldn't be that hard. My apple tree wasn't able to grow last night. Oh, that's right. I need to fix that, don't I? Clear and sunny. Perfect for the weather of the dance of the moonlight jellies. I forgot it. 10 p.m. and 12 a.m. Okay, so that's not the full day at all. Welcome back to Wellwick's Oracle. If you speak, blah, blah, blah. displeased because why not? Okay, well that's fine. Again, I don't plan on really going back to the mines in a hot second. I guess I should keep the pail in a chest outside of the area, shouldn't I? Still in case those do anything. Let's see, pail. So yeah, I'm gonna do my chores and I'll figure out what to do for most of the day, I guess. Hmm, I do have a genuine question. Why hasn't my apple tree been- Oh my god, really? Get out of here, dude. I'm also kind of certain that this thing's also blocking it. So I just gotta get rid of that. Give some room for my boy here. I need to get all the apples I can. Plus, it'll be, you know, money if I can get it earlier than rather than sooner. Cool, so what's going on here? I think by tomorrow we'll have our- Oh! Okay, another rainbow shell. Well, that's good, because I wanted to show off both of the uses the rainbow shell got. I only got one. Huh, that doesn't happen often. There's multiple uses for the rainbow shell in terms of specifically making clothes, so I thought it'd be interesting to show both of those uses. Just get rid of all that. And of course, those can go into my rod, which is using up bait at an alarming rate. I was surprised I didn't actually get a level of fishing last night because I did a lot of fishing. Given we're also really high on levels, so leveling's going to come a lot slower after that. Uh, let's see. What am I doing? Well, first of all, I should actually complete some of those bundles that we have a germinating with the red snapper and ghost fish. Let's see, I have 8,000. What can I even do with that at this point? Because I can't go to Robin, I can't go to Clint. Because I literally have both of them work. I mean, I guess this is a good thing, isn't it? I'll just save it, I suppose. Weird concept, I know, but hey, whatever. Don't eat the red snapper. This is like one of the last times I'm going to get a chance to get it. Of course, it does show up and fall, but still, you know what I mean. Well... Let's make it a point to start giving some people some gifts today, I suppose. I do have this corn that can go in there as well. Not that it's going to finish a bundle, but hey. I have the sunflower still. Don't worry, I won't forget it. I promise. I really do promise. That's not what I clicked on. So let's grab amethysts. Why is sap in here? Hello? <laughs> Amethyst, emerald... And a frozen tear. And hey, can't forget driftwood. Let's go. Hey! Whoa! Didn't expect that. It's a fairly low chance for you to get row this early on, but hey, man. Can be aged in a preserved jar to bring out more flavor. Yeah, we're keeping that. We're saving that for a rainy day. Actually, you know what? We have a preserved jar open. Funny you ask, say that gonna put that row in there so there's something special with specifically sturgeon row that we're going to get out of that so look forward to it and this is also the reason that i made a pond specifically of sturgeon hello leah 
you're always home. It's very easy to give you gifts now since we have enough friendship with you. What are we? Two hearts still. Okay. I'll work on that. Don't you worry. Oh, you know what? I guess I could s just save all the money for when we need to upgrade our coupon barn. Because I'd like to get those upgraded fully by the end of fall, if at all possible. That would be very convenient for us. I should have brought back... He's coming back soon. Are you sure about that? I should have brought a Joja Cola for them. Emily should still be in her house. Oh. Mm, I just can't get this jar open. Oh, it's you. Rob, right? Say, you're pretty strong, aren't you? No, yes. Great, then you shouldn't have any problem opening this jar for me. Hey, you did it. You're stronger than you look. Thanks. Man, speaking of deep emotional cutscenes, guess it's been a while since we've... Uh, oh... This has definitely got friendship changed, and I'm thinking Snoop around your room is probably a fat negative 50. Uh, care for plants. Hmm, sounds like a lot of work. Yellow. What's yellow again? Oh, I can't. I'll never know. Emily's still in her room. Good. Oh, man, I forgot. I should have brought the uh, rainbow shell and some cloth over here, because I want to check out what that makes. Because, I mean, it's a, it's a pretty item. I'd expect it to make a pretty thing. Uh, why do I have a rainbow? Oh, yeah, because Demetrius gave it to me. I have? Yeah. Oh, it is Saturday. Yeah, I guess our gifts haven't reset. Yo, who's not in the docket? Uh, Pierre. Pierre, oddly enough. Leah. And that's it. Everyone else is free to give items to. Good. Sebastian, I have a special gift for you. Please don't give it to Sam. Thank you. Good stuff. Tomorrow we'll be gathering at the docks to see the migration of the moonlight jellies. I think it starts at 10 o'clock. That's right. People are going to start talking about all that. Yo, Penny. Mountain looks nice today, don't they? Sure. I think the... No, the Starship Saloon opens at 12. Let's see. What to do? I guess I could go to the... We have that mission to get the bronze or the copper. I guess I could go into the mines just really, to be honest for funsies <laughs> because I have very little other things to do. Lewis, how funny you would appear here when I have a gold star hot pepper. I'm gonna be keeping all of those in my inventory from now on because there's no reason for me to get rid of them because I wanna use them for gifts for both Pierre and for, oh, you know his name, Shane, for the rest of the year, so. I'll be keeping an eye on those. Also, let's go ahead and drop off all of these items. So the ghost fish isn't going to complete the specialty fish bundle. And honestly, if I had bought the sand fish, I could have just finished it out outright. You know what? It might have been worth it. But we are going to finish the ocean fish bundle. I have no idea what this is going to give me. Probably bait. Oh, beach totems. Okay. And all that leaves is walleye, tiger trout... And sandfish, all of which can be gotten in fall. So hopefully we should be able to finish up the fish tank then. What else did I have? Corn? Yeah, really, just pop it in. Who cares? Hopefully we're able to get five more of those five, uh, gold star corns because that will finish up the quality crops bundle. And then it's just the animal bundle. We already have large milk germinating. We're going to have to buy two other animals to get whatever those need because these are all given from different animals. Just in case you thought that a duck egg and wool came from the same animal, you know? Okay. Well, wasn't it terrible luck today, though? Man, maybe I shouldn't go to the mines to try and complete that. What I should do, however, is sell all my adventurer's stuff. Oh. Oh. Oh, hello, Rob. Dirty boy. 
What, you haven't seen my motorcycle before? Hmm, I guess I haven't shown it to you. Sometimes, after sundown, I make a long ride out of Stardew Valley. There's nothing else like it, blazing along the empty stretch of road toward this faint city glow. Once, I save, once I've saved up enough money, I'm going to head out on my own, to the city and beyond, just me and my bike. There we go, oil's changed. Hey, maybe I'll let you ride sometime if you want. That sounds fun. Great. Oh, we're starting to get in there with big ol' sea bass. All right, cool. So, hmm. I'll try my luck at the mines for a little bit just to see what we can get going. Oh, don't need new friends. Well, too bad, you're getting one. Just to see what we get for luck. If I can get the copper ore, great. If I can't, oh well. I need to get it within like the next three hours though, don't I? Oops, well, that's unlikely, but at least I have the minecart right here if I ever need it. Oh! We, we met a monster slayer goal. So that's for the insects one. It's usually the first one that you complete. So when we take a trip to the adventurers guild, we'll also be able to do that as well. Okay, we got it, but literally just barely. And I don't know if we're going to get to Clinton time because I believe he closes at four. I might be able to actually just make it in, uh, but I wouldn't be able to give it to, well, I don't have, it doesn't have to be during business hours. I just, wrong place. I just have to get in. Oh, you saw that tick down, dude. And this is the last day to do it, isn't it? Oh, that's disgusting. And the worst part is he barely ever leaves his house. Is he going to do it? Is he going to leave his house today? I really hope he is. Did I already talk to Haley? That's right. We had that thing. Man. Man. That's just unfortunate. Jeez. Well... What to do? Well, let's go back to the mines because the Adventurers Guild is open. I guess I'll check at the saloon. It is Saturday, so it's going to be pretty packed if I remember correctly. So hopefully it is packed. So if you check our missions here, you can see that we did in fact kill, I believe it's the 120 cave insects that we needed to. That one's super easy because not only do they spawn often, but it also counts the grubs, the flying ones, the ones that give you bug meat. Like all of those are counted. And then look at this, 17 out of 60 rock crabs, despite those being in the entire mines. And then a thousands, yeah, yeah, bugs are the easiest. And we get an insect head, which is interesting. 10 to 20 damage. See, this would have been really good to get earlier. It's not terrible. 10 to 20 damage, two plus two speed, speed plus two crit chance. But this is just better in every single way, so we really have no use for it. I will sell it. Hey, it's a fat 200. Not too bad. Small magnet. Still. That's actually not a small amount of money. Uh, lava katana is the next thing we could buy, but I don't think I'll ever do that. I don't think I'll need the lava katana. We'll probably be able to get something better than that real fast. I believe the space boots is what we have. We also have all these rings here that you could get if you want. Weapon speed is good. Critical strike chance. If you're building that way, it could be fine. Precision. Uh, that must be for the slingshots. Knock back. Not terrible stuff. And also, he'll sell you back the insect head for 10,000, even though we sold it to him for 200. There's practically no reason we'd ever need it. The steel falchion is better in any in every way. Well, okay. What to do now? I did get a good amount of copper ore, even though I wasn't able to actually give it to Clint. I guess I could just do yet some more fishing. What's our foraging level at? Because I could try to get that up, continue to try to get that up for a little bit. Oh, hey, actually, I have a amethyst for you. I actually completely forgot about finding you. My bad. Shane will definitely be at the saloon tonight, so I'll just give him the hot pepper then. 
You know, what you go to a bar for, being given hot peppers. Well, hey, do we have any fruit in the fruit cave? It's been a while since I checked it. Yeah, I guess we do, huh? Some blackberries, apricot, wild plum, spice berries, and I'm actually full. Funny how I was like, oh, we don't have to worry about our inventory ever again. And ever since then, I've been worrying about my inventory. All right, it's getting pretty late. I should go to the saloon real soon. I didn't realize how late it was getting how fast. Saturday night, give me Clint. You brought the oars I requested. Great. These oars look to be of good quality. You can keep them, of course. Here's your payment. Did I have them in my inventory? I didn't actually even have them in my inventory. Also 340. I didn't see what achievement I got either. It was kind of like obscured a bit. Gopher. Complete 10 help wanted quests. I want to see, say I genuinely have never done that before. Anyway, I do have the pepper for you. Who'd have thunk you'd be here? I was kind of hoping Sam would be here because I did bring a Joja Cola as well. You kind of do hate to see it. Mm, I should have brought like, I don't know, a bar or something for Clint. Would have been nice. Go ahead and talk to everyone while we're here. There's no reason not to. I always see Clint here, but he won't talk to anyone. He just glances over his shoulder every now and again. Oh, because Emily. Poor kid. Poor kid. Rice pudding. Yeah. Remember when I gave that to a certain someone? Wasn't that great? Wasn't that a good old time? I'm feeling charitable. Even though I literally have pale ales out the wazoo. Why not? Pam isn't responding. Why? Is she just absolutely guzzling right now? She's almost at 10 hearts. That's crazy. Doing real well with her, which is kind of rare. Just to confirm, they're not here, right? Yeah. All right. Well, that's fine, I suppose. Cool. Well, that'll wrap up the second of last day to summer. Man, I think tomorrow... Hmm. No, I can't. I was going to say I'll put my watering can in, but uh, there's really not a reason to do that. I'm hoping for one more yield of honey, but I don't think we're actually going to get it. Uh, which is fine. I guess I could just keep the sunflower a little bit into fall and then take it out whenever we get that yield of honey. Because there's another plant I'd rather put in there. I need to put this away. We're going to get quite a bit of money from this tonight. I Don't, don't ask me why I have this earth crystal. Because even I have no idea. It goes in the gems. Okay. The gems also doubles as a gift-giving section, so if you're wondering why these are there, that's why. Anyway, that'll do it. Join me in the next episode when we'll probably be starting fall. And you know what? Hold on before I forget. I just want to make sure to do this like every few days. You don't have to do it every single day, but as long as you like keep constant on it, somewhat constant, you'll have it perfected. All right. Well, see you in the next episode. We'll be ending summer, and we'll be starting fall. See you all then, and goodbye.